Hello, Dr. Ben Gelfand here, and today we're going to discuss a very simple but profound test for evaluation of the hip. This test, known as the log roll, uh, tests for internal derangement of the hip, such as labral tears, joint laxity, which can be from the capsule, and arthritis, which can be seen by quality of movement and the presence of crepitus. So to do this test, we will put one hand just above the knee or the distal femur, and one hand just above the ankle. And then we will roll into external rotation. And it's important that you don't stop short. You wanna go into the end feel, cause that's gonna be part of how we judge the laxity or lack of laxity. So we go all the way in uh, to external rotation to the end feel. And once we're confident we're at the end, no bouncing, but once we're at the confident we're at the end, then we will bring the leg into internal rotation all the way to the end feel. As you see, Hannah has much more internal rotation than external rotation, and that's because we know that she has some hip dysplasia or antiversion in this case. So once again, we grab from just above the knee, just above the ankle, so we have good uh, mechanical advantage, bring it into external rotation, into the end feel, noting range of motion, noting quality of movement, feeling for any crepitus and looking for any pain. And then we go the other way right into internal rotation. Once again, all the way to the end feel, noting amount of motion, crepitus, quality of movement, and or the reports of pain. Then we compare it to the other side. That is the log roll test for the hip. Thank you and be well.